It is really hard, always really hard, to be faithful, to keep our eyes focused. One of the Beatitudes, which I love, it says, Blessed are the pure in heart, the pure in spirit, for they shall inherit the kingdom of heaven. Now, purity is about focus. It's about being able to keep our eyes on the prize, not to be distracted by things of this world. Because, believe me, there are so many things that distract us from what God has called us to do. And it is a battle. It is a constant war that we have, a constant tug of war that we have against the things of the world. Just imagine yourself pulling against a rope. And there you are by yourself, trying to pull against all the temptations, all the distractions of the world. People's expectation, that's one person pulling. The next person pulling is thoughts and, and temptations. And you're trying to pull against these. And then materialism and, and, and expectations of our own self. And we're pulling and we're pulling and we're trying to live this Christian life, but we're being pulled in the opposite direction. And it is really hard, it is really difficult. And I would say this, it is absolutely impossible to live faithfully today unless we use God to help us pull against the currents of this world. You see, this is the problem, that we are trying to pull without the power of the Holy Spirit. We're trying to pull without the power of God. We're trying to pull and trying to win this war. And we're saying, God, I'll be okay. I can handle this. Or we're not making the effort, the, the sacrifice of falling to our knees and crying out to a God who will tie this rope around his waist. And he will not only hold us strong, he will not only help us keep away from these temptations, but all he needs to do is to take a little step back with us in his arms, and everything collapses. The temptations, the sinfulness, the addictions, the expectations of others, but be aware of God with you. Don't lose heart. Don't forget what God has promised for you. And why? Because of the cross. Because of what Jesus has done for you on the cross. Without the cross, this is absolutely impossible. But because of the cross, we can fight this battle. Let's ask God for strength. Let's ask God for the, the breakthrough that we need to overcome, especially those of you who feel right now that it is impossible to win this war, who finds it impossible and we're being dragged to the other side, to a place of defeat. Well, God has victory for you. God has won the battle for you. Just allow God to fight this battle for you. Stop trying to do it yourself. You cannot. Fall to your knees. Cry out to God. Worship God who alone has the power to save you. I'm so grateful for Jesus in my life. I'm so grateful that no matter how far gone we might feel or seem, God has the power to save us. God has the power to win. When all seems lost, turn to the Lord. He is the God of victory. He will surprise you. Trust in Him. Depend on Him. Rely on Jesus.